Damn. Hey, hello, Brenda. Good night. How are you? Hi, teacher. Good night. Uh, a little tired. Are you tired? Yeah. Too much work? Ah, uh, yes, a little. <laughs> okay, good, good. But it's Monday. You should be full of energy. Yes, but my... Weekend in the summer? Yes, my weekend. My weekend, very tight. Were, were you busy on the weekend? Estuvo ocupada en fin de semana? Were you busy on the weekend? Mm, not really, but uh, personal inconvenience. Oh, sorry. Sorry to hear that. Sorry to hear that, okay? Cool. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Just take and it you, easy. Teacher. Oh, I'm good. I'm, I, you know, my, my weekend was really nice. I, I went to El Volcan. Uh, some friends took me to a new place over there at Volcan. Uh, it was really nice, really nice. I enjoy it. And we ate pupusas with hot chocolate. What? Okay. Uh, I, I like revueltas. No, ¿cuál volcán? Pues se llama el lugar. Here in San Salvador, Boquerón over there. Ah, uh, yeah. Yes. Oh, uh, good. It's like Plaza del Volcán, I think. I think that's, that's um, what it's called, Plaza del Volcán. I don't know, teacher. I don't visit this place. <laughs> you, you don't visit those places. Why? It's no. Good. Go, go no. and have fun. That's why you're tired. Look. Don't only work, you have to have fun, you know? Like, if you are yes. only working, no fun, come on. You have to go out with your friends or go look the city, whatever. But you have to distract yourself. No, not only working, not only working. That's not good. Because the yes, stress, stress is going to get you, the stress, you know? And the stress is really bad. That's why. Yes, yeah. but... Me, I work every day and I work like all day, even through the night until the morning. But on the weekend, I go to the beach, I go to anywhere. I, you know, I'm, I'm a vago, vago. <laughs> so that's, that, that's, that's how you do it. Because if you are stressed, then, you know, you might get like very tired, very tired. Okay, cool. Uh, yeah. Do you have family teacher? Mm, wife yeah. children oh no no wife no wife no no not yet not yet uh, mm -mm. children no no not yet not yet uh, but i want three <laughs> i want three i want what i want one daughter and two boys uh, okay good <laughs> uh, hopefully maybe in i don't know maybe two years in two years. Oh, okay. <laughs> but maybe, Good. maybe. We don't know. We don't know. <laughs> Me too, one. <laughs> well, only one? Why? I, I, I don't know. You should have I five. I don't have five. patience. No, teacher. 
No, I don't have patience. Paciencia, patience. I'm not. I'm not patient. I'm not patient. I'm not patient. Oh, yes. man. <laughs> well, for me, it's good because I'm practicing with my with my little cousins, you know, mis sobrinitos. So I'm practicing with them. Uh, they love me. They go, tío, tío, here, tío, there. So, you know, I'm, I'm just giving them all. Me, me too, but. Quizás por eso, ¿no? <laughs> no, I, I love, I love, I love my, my, my little cousins. They're, they're pretty nice. They're pretty nice. Okay. But, good night. My, hey, good night, good night. And, and that's night. why my, 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 like my family, they say, um, they, they, they say that I am, in Spanish, they call me what? Um, they use a word to tell me because I, I, you know, I spoil them. It is muy, como me dicen? Alcahueto. Alcahueto, yeah, de alcahueto, porque los consiento mucho, yeah, yeah. Por eso les cae bien. <laughs> okay, okay, everybody, welcome to the class. I'm welcoming you to a new week. This is week number four, oh, wait, number three. <laughs> I'm going ahead. This is week number three. So we are going to start uh, with um, section number four, section number four tonight. And today is Wednesday, November 9th. Uh, welcome, everybody. So, you know, English, English Corporativo is giving you this spot so you can study English. So thanks to them, we are doing this session, okay? So let's see. Okay. Let me just go and share my PowerPoint presentation. Here we go. Can everybody see the PowerPoint presentation? Yes. Cool. Okay, let me just move this here. I'm hoping that everybody gets um, online tonight. Good. There it is. Okay. Mm -hmm. I see that, well, I have many people here, but let's see. Let's start the, let's start the class. Okay, remember the rules for the visual classroom. Log in on time. The class is at 9 p.m. Turn on your cameras, pay attention and be ready, please. Pay attention and be ready because we don't want to waste time. No queremos desperdiciar el tiempo, so you need to be alert. Um, mic off after participating. So whenever you finish participating, turn off your microphone, please. Uh, follow instructions and speak up loud. Another thing that I want to say is that I'm going to add later to these rules is that you need to be apart from no, you don't have to be in the living room or on the kitchen because too many noises, too many noises, okay? Um, good, so any questions? Everybody, no questions? No, no cool, questions. cool, moving on then. So let's start. And this session is called the biggest and the best, the biggest and the best. That is the name of this section. So let's see the section's achievement indicator. Um, successfully identify, discuss, and talk about describing countries, making comparisons, expressing opinions, talking about distances and measurements. Everybody repeat. <clears throat> Very good. So that's what we're going to be doing. And also we're going to be talking about distances, distances. Okay. So let's see. Uh, 4.0, 4.0 achievement indicator. In this class, participants will learn new vocabulary related to geography. Ge related to geography. Everybody reading, please. In this, in class, this class, class, participants, participants will learn, will learn new vocabulary, new vocabulary related, related, to related to geography. Related, related, related to geography. Okay, very good. Related. Okay, let's begin. Listen to this question. Which beaches have you visited on your vacations? One more time. Which beaches have you visited on your vacations? Everybody. Which beaches have you visited on your vacations? 
which beaches have you visited on your vacations? Everybody. Which beaches have you visited on your vacations? Have you visited on your vacations? Well, let's see. I have been to Cuco Beach so many times. As a matter of fact, that is my favorite beach. But I also have been to Costa del Sol, San Marcelino, Puerto de la Libertad, and El Tunco. Everybody. Well, well, let's see. Well, let's see. Well, I have, I have been, been to Turco Beach so, so many times. times. As a matter of fact, fact that it is my favorite, my favorite beach. beach. But I, I also have, have, have been to Costa del Sol, San Marcelino, and San Marcelino. San Marcelino. San Marcelino. San Marcelino. I also have been to Costa Rica, so San Marcelino, Puerto de la Libertad, and El Tunco. Good. How many volcanoes have you climbed? How many volcanoes have you climbed? Everybody? How many, How many volcanoes, volcanoes have you climbed? How many volcanoes have you climbed? How many volcanoes have you climbed? For sure, the Chaparrastique volcano, Cerro Verde, and the Matepec volcano in Santa Ana and Izalco. Everybody. In which rivers have you swam? 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 swam? Definitely in Rio Grande, Rio Lempa, Son Pool, in Salatenango, Rio Huascoran, Rio Torola, and Rio Sapo in Arambala. Everybody? Definitely in Rio Grande, Rio Lempa, Son Pool, in Salatenango, Rio Huascoran, Rio Torola, and Rio Sapo in Arambala. In Arambala. How many waterfalls have you been to? How many waterfalls have you been to? How many waterfalls have you been to? Yeah, I have been to Chorros de la Calera in Huayua, Los Tercios, Los Tercios in Suchitoto, Salto de Malacuatepan in Aguachapan, Salto El Perol, and Cascada del Cañón in Perquín. Yeah, yeah, I have Okay, any questions about this slide? Questions, questions. I am surprised. You are? Why? Why? Uh, because I read many places that I don't know. Hey, I told you I was vago. Yo les dije que yo soy vago. So <laughs> wow. Whenever I am in one place, I need to know everything from that place. And maybe when yeah, uh, maybe when I maybe when I get a, a job and I have a money, I could go all this place that you are. Wait, wait, wait. Gay at. Yesenia, you can do you can do like me. Get a job that gets you somewhere. Like my job, it sends me all over the places, you know? That's why I, oh. I, 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 get, I get around. I get around. I get around. But I think that mm -hmm. I need to speak very well English. In my case, I don't speak very well, I think. You're going to. Lo va a hacer. You're going to. Don't worry okay. about it, okay? I hope. If you continue practicing, you're going to get the experience, okay? Okay, thank you. Cool, cool. Okay, uh, questions, guys, questions? No? No, teacher. Okay, cool. Um, a screenshot, a screenshot. Good? Good, yeah. Okay, let's go practice. Everybody has the screenshot? Um, Guys, everybody yeah. has the screenshot? Yeah. yeah. Okay. I don't want to hear, no teacher, I don't, I don't have the screenshot. Wow, my mom, my mom. <laughs> okay, let's go. Okay. So. 
what I'm talking about. Sorry, sorry. It's okay, don't worry. It's okay. Um, now, guys, what I need you to do, open up your cameras. Open up your cameras. We're going to do a live, uh, we're going to do a live session and a live practice. Practice live, live, live. English live. ¿Han escuchado ese, 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 ese comercial? English live, ¿no? But this is yes. English face to face, face to face. <laughs> <laughs> okay, ready? Okay, remember that my 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 software recognizes only cameras on. El software que tengo solo reconoce las cámaras que están encendidas. Please, please. So turn on your cameras. Okay, ready. Number one. Which beaches have you visited on vacation? So that's the first one. Lydia, uh, which beaches have you visited on your vacations? Teacher, regáñeme. Es que me quedé esperando que pusieran la, la captura de pantalla a, ahí en el grupo y por eso no tengo con mi okay. teléfono. Can somebody send us <laughs> regáñeme. To WhatsApp for Lidia. Lidia. <laughs> es, que, es que otras veces lo ponen y yo miro más bonito que cuando yo tomo foto con mi teléfono y no. estaba buscando. <laughs> I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. Can, can somebody send it to the, to, to the WhatsApp, please? <laughs> Okay, let's wait, Lydia. Okay, it, so I'm going to change. Let's let's find um, Catherine. Catherine, which beaches have you visited on your vacations? Well, let's see. I have been to Cuco Beach so many times. As a matter of fact, that is my favorite beach. But I also have been to Costa del Sol, San Marcelino, Puerto de la Libertad, and El Tunco. Very good. Catherine, as Byron. Byron, how many volcanoes have you climbed? For sure, the Chaparastical volcano, Cerro Verde, <clears throat> Yamatepec volcano in Santa Ana and in Salco. Okay, Byron, ask Marcela. Marcela, in which rivers have you snow? No, have you swam? Swam. Wait, wait, one more time, Byron. Okay, Marcela, in, in which rivers have you swam? Definitely. In Rio Grande. Where, where did oh. she go? Here I am. Sorry. Again? Definitely, definitely in Rio Grande, Rio Lempa. Wait, wait, definitely, 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 again, please, definitely, definitely, mm -hmm. Definitely in Rio Grande, Rio Lempa, Zumpul in Chalatenango, Rio Huascoran, Rio Torola, and Rio Sapo in Arambala. All right. Okay. Marce, ask Felix. Felix, how many waterfalls have you been to? Felix, how many waterfalls have you been to? Remember, pay attention and stay ready. Stay ready. Come on. Okay, Karen, can you can you uh, Karen, how many waterfalls have you been to? Um, yeah, I have been to Chorro de la Calera in Huayua, Los Terces in Suchitoto, Salto de Malacatiupan in uh, in Aguachapan, Salto El Ferol, and Cascada del Cañón in Perkin. Very good, nice. Ask Rocio, please. Rocio, which beaches have you visited on your vacation? Rocio, your, your, your microphone. Thank you. Okay. Well, let's, let's see. I have been to Google Beach so many times in matter of... As a matter, as a matter of fact. Matter of fact. That is my favorite beach, but I also have been to Costa del Sol, San Marcelino, Puerto de la Libertad, in El Cuco. Very El good. Tunco. 
El cuco. Bye. That's good. Don't worry. That's my favorite bitch anyway. Yeah, that's good. That's good. Okay, Rocío, ask Maudi. Maudi, how many volcanoes have you climbed? Climbed. 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 Okay. Climbed. Uh, Maudi, how many volcanoes have you climbed? Ah, okay. It's la number two, verdad? Yes, yes, yes. Ah, okay, okay. For sure, the Chaparastique volcano, Cerro Verde, La Matepec volcano, in Santa Ana, and Pisalco. Very good. Ask Lester. Lester, in which rivers have you swim? No, swam, swam. Now, ah, in, you, in which rivers have you swam? Lester? In Rio Grande. Lester? Definitely, definitely in Rio Grande. Okay, um, as Denny. Danny, how many waterfalls have you been to? Yeah, I have, have been to Chorros de la Calera in Huayua, Los Tercios in Chichitoto, Salto de Malac... Malacochipan. Malacatulopan. <laughs> come on, Danny, come on. <laughs> Ese está peor que el inglés. Salto del Perol y en Cascadas del Cañón in Perquín. Very good. Okay. Um, um, as Aldini. Aldini, which beach, which beaches have you visited? Visited on your vacation. Well, let's see. I have been to Cuckoo Beach so so many times. As a model of fact, that is my favorite beach, but. E, but I also have been to Costa del Sol, San Marcelino, Puerto de la Libertad, and El Cuco. What? El Cuco. <laughs> eso se pega, eso se pega, eh. Eso se pega, ya vi, ya vi. <laughs> ah, el Tunco, perdón. <laughs> okay. And El Tunco, es que con el celular lo estoy viendo. Ok, Aldini, ask Katherine. Oh, oh, momento. Ya how, wait, wait, ya how many volcanoes have you climbed? Brenda, Brenda, how many volcanoes have you climbed? Brenda, how many volcanoes have you climbed? Brenda? Yes. There, <laughs> there you go, there you go. For sure. The Chaparastique Volcano, Cerro Verde, y la Mateque Volcano, y Santa Ana, en Isalco. Very good. Uh, okay, Brenda, ask Marixa. In which rivers have you swung? The Chichiti, the Tangeli, in Rio Grande, Rio Lenta, Cintilin, Salatenango, Rio Guascorán, Rio Perola, and Rio Sapo, in Arambala. Thank you, thank you very much. Ask Claudia. How many waterfalls have you been to? Yeah, I have been to Chorros de la Calera in Huayuda, Los Tercios in Suchitoto, Salto de Malacatipan in Huachapan, Salto del Perol in Cascada del Cañón in Perquín. Very good. Ask Lydia. <laughs> Lydia, which beaches have you visited on your vacation? Well, let us see. I have been to Cuco Beach so many times. As a matter of fact, that is my favorite beach. But I also have been to Costa del Sol, San Marcelino, Puerto de la Libertad, and El Tunco. Very good. Thank you very much. All right, guys. So as you can see, we are talking about geography. Um, in, in the platform, they are talking about international geography, but I, I like to do internal internal geography because so many people they don't know these places like i was telling i was teaching this same class to other students and they were teacher 
there's no there's no tunko beach i was like what this is the most famous tunko you know like all people from other countries they come to El tunko i can say that many people cannot know san marcelino si puedo decir que san marcelino casi mucha gente no la conoce but because it's very small it's very small but it's nice i love it i love it there in, in san marcelino okay good let's move on um let's see what is next vamos a ver lo que uh, how many students do I have? 23, 22. 22. 22, 22, 22. 23 with me. With me, but 22. Okay, okay let's see what, what is next. Veamos que sigue. I think this is the most interesting class. I mean, this section because I'm going to be talking about El Salvador all alone. Okay? So let's see what is next. Okay, 4.2 achievement indicator. Participants will listen to a conversation about geography. Comparisons with adjectives will first be introduced. Everybody. Good. So in this case, we're going to check the most important things that we need to check are two. Number one, comparisons. And number two, okay, so let's see. Guys, guys, después de, después de participar. ¿Quién está soplando? Sí, después de participar, dijo la regla que después de participar, apaguen en su micrófono. Please, please. Ok, um, listen to this. Which Central America country is larger, Guatemala or Honduras? Which Central America country is larger, Guatemala or Honduras? Everybody. Which Central America country is larger? Central America country is larger than Guatemala or Honduras. Guatemala or Honduras. Hey, hey, in English, Guatemala, Honduras. Honduras. Guatemala or Honduras. Honduras. Guatemala or Honduras. 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 Good. Listen, listen. Honduras is larger than Guatemala. It has 112,090 kilometers versus Guatemala having 108,889 kilometers. Everybody? Hundred and forty nine kilometers. 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 One hundred twelve thousand, one hundred twelve thousand, one hundred twelve thousand. Todos. One hundred twelve thousand, one hundred twelve thousand, one hundred twelve thousand. Todos. One hundred twelve thousand, one hundred twelve thousand. One hundred twelve thousand. One hundred twelve thousand. One hundred twelve thousand. Okay, otra vez. 112,000. 112,000. 112,000. 90 112,090 
Okay, listen to this. This one. 108,000, 108,000, 108,000, 108,000, 108,000, 108,000, <risa> Primero escuchen, ¿ok? Ahora lo voy a decir todo junto para que todos lo digan. Look, look. 108,000, 108,000, kilómetros. Todos. 108,000, ¿Qué me está diciendo kilómetro? Es kilómetros, kilómetros. Kilómetro. Kilómetro. Nunca dije kilómetro. Es kilómetro. 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 Y acuérdense que esta sección es de medidas. Así que vamos a estar utilizando números. Ojo. Ok, next. Which country is larger, Canada or China? 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 Or China. China. Canada is larger than China. Canada is larger than China. Which city has the largest population? Tokyo, Mexico City, or Sao Paulo? Which city has the largest population? Tokyo, Mexico City, or Sao Paulo? Which city has the largest city, Mexico City, or Sao Paulo? Which city has the largest population? Tokyo, Mexico City, or Sao Paulo? Tokyo has the largest population of the three. Tokyo has the largest population of the three. What is the most beautiful mountain in the world? What is the most beautiful mountain in the world? Most most in the world. world. I think Mount Fuji is the most beautiful. I think Mount Fuji is the most beautiful. Fuji most beautiful. Okay. Questions? Questions here? No questions? Good. A screenshot. A screenshot. A screenshot to practice. A screenshot to practice. Teacher, teacher ahí tiene equivocada la palabra. Tokyo has the largest. Yeah, largest. So you said last yes. Oh, yeah, my bad, my bad. Recuerden que esto lo hago a las 3 de la mañana cuando termino. Ay, no, teacher, eso no te había dicho, le dije. Teacher, y el Fuji, así se pronuncia. Fuji, Fuji. Fuji. Fuji, ah, ok, gracias. Fuji. Fuji. Ok, ¿ya tienen el screenshot? Sí. Ok, good, moving on. Ok, um, primero hagamos el... el El, el ejercicio y después vamos a los comparisons que es la gramática ok let's go come on okay so i'm going to send you to your rooms please listen to your classmates and make corrections please let's go many one two three four four Okay, go to your rooms and start practicing. Go to your rooms and start practicing.
Which Central America country is larger, Guatemala or Honduras? Capita. Honduras is larger than Guatemala. Guatemala. It has 112,090 kilometers versus Guatemala having uh, 108,890. 800, 899 kilómetros. 899 America country is larger Guatemala or Honduras? Honduras is larger than Guatemala. It has 112,090 kilometers um, versus Guatemala having uh, 108,889 kilometers. Good. Pregúntale a alguien más. Marixa, which Central America country is larger, Guatemala or Honduras? Honduras is larger than Guatemala. It has 112,090 kilometers versus Guatemala having. 108,889 kilometers. No, 889, 889 kilometers. 889 kilometers. Uh, Lester. Uh, Lester, this Central America country is larger. Guatemala or Honduras? Honduras is larger, larger than Guatemala. It has 112,090 kilometers versus Guatemala having 108,889 kilometers. Good. That's no Noé, which Central America country is larger, Guatemala or Honduras? Honduras is larger than Guatemala. It has 112,090 kilometers. Kilometers, kilometers, kilometers. Kilometers. Versus Guatemala having 108,000. 8,000. Eight, 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 no. 800. Eight, uh -huh. 800. 889 eight, kilometers. 889 eight, kilometers. Eight, 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 one hundred eight eight thousand. Uh -huh. eight hundred eight hundred eighty nine. Eighty nine kilos. Complicado. Yeah. <laughs> Complicado. <laughs> uh, which country is larger, Canada or China? Canada is larger than China. Which city has the largest population? Tokyo, Mexico City, or Sao Paulo? Yo, la música, teacher. Yeah, this is my discotheque. Come on, man. My discotheque. The teacher's discotheque. 
listen to this i like this mix you like it it's like sounds around okay guys um wait let's wait for everybody let's wait This is 90s music it, it's or good 80s. For romantic music. I like romantic music. Okay. It doesn't matter which which year, I love romantic music. <laughs> okay. You don't like it? No, I don't Sounds like good. It. Sounds good. <laughs> this is from a movie. This is from the movie Maniki. I like it. I love it. I love it. <laughs> okay, let me see if the car is coming. <laughs> okay, so I have everybody. Okay, guys, listen. Uh, you guys are, are mixing. You need to check the numbers, guys. We need to check the numbers. Maybe what I'm going to do is that I'm going to prepare a class. I'm going, to, I don't know, I'm, I need to squeeze a class about numbers. Guys, you're not really good with numbers. So we need to, to be working with numbers, but big numbers, not one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. No, I mean big numbers, 1,000, 10,000, 100,000, 55,000, and so on, okay? <laughs> I'm going to prepare a class so we can work on that, okay? Because I was listening and your numbers are not good. No good, okay? But I'm going to fix it. We we are going to fix it, okay? Cool. All right. So let's see what we have next. Let's see what we have next. What is it? All right, here we go. Let's go with the next thing we have is comparison. So this is the grammar. Esta es la gramática que debemos de entender sobre los comparativos. Um, remember, I'm including this because you said you liked it the other day. So, la, la vez pasada dijeron que les gustaba la gramática que había incluido, así que voy incluyendo esta otra también, ¿ok? It's good. So, let's begin. Yes. Comparisons. Let's see. Um, Samuel, Samuel, you start reading. Uh... The comparative form of an adjective is commonly used to compare to people, things, or states. When you amount of a quality than a, another. Okay, good. So the comparative is to, to talk about or compare things, people, and states, okay? So it's comparative. When you use comparatives, you okay. use two things, two people, or more. Okay, so not, not only one. It has to be two or more. Questions about this slide? Uh, the pronunciation, the commonly. Commonly, commonly. Commonly. Yeah, commonly. Commonly, commonly, commonly. Good. Okay, Reina, uh, can you do this, please? If the second part of the comparison in comparison, the comparison, comparison, comparison is mean, mean, mentioned, is followed that. Anna is taller than Mary, but... Wait, 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 wait. Pronunciation. Then, then, if the second part of the comparison is mentioned, it follows then, then. then. Okay? Then. Anna is taller than Mary, but Mary is older. Emma is much slimmer? Slimmer? Slimmer. Slimmer? <laughs> Emma... <laughs> Is much slimmer that when and I then, then pronunciation then 
them. <laughs> then when I last saw her, online learning is less expensive than conventional college courses. Courses, courses. Courses, thanks. Course, courses, course, courses. Okay, guys, any questions here? What is slimmer? Uh, slimmer. Slimmer is like, um, okay, now I'm fat. The teacher is fat. But if I do exercise every day, I'm going to be Delgado. slimmer. Delgado? Yeah. So, en este momento estoy fat, pero si hago ejercicio, me voy a poner slimmer. Delgado, yeah. I wish. <laughs> en mis sueños. <laughs> Forever, gordito. <laughs> Okay, good. Any questions, guys? Any questions? Courses. 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 Son cursos. O sea, o, o, o materias. Okay? Cool. Okay, Aldini, can you read this, please? Comparison, comparison is with you are considering whether two people of team are equal, equal 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 is shown by using as as in the affirmative and not as as or not so as in the negative helen is as tall as linda but not as strong very good so comparison is considering Aquí hay dos opciones. That, that's what, it, what it's calling. It's, it's showing us two options. Nos muestra dos opciones. Helen is tall. As Linda. Dice, Helen es tan alta como Linda, pero no tan fuerte. Got it? Yeah. Okay, so, sí dice una que es positiva, pero también dice una que es negativa. Questions, preguntas. Very cool. Teacher, teacher, Show, teacher. Go. Show. What? ¿Qué es? ¿Cómo se pronuncia chao? Chao. Bye. Sean, Sean. Uh, two people or things are equal is Sean. Eh, ¿Cuál es Sean? Sean. Sean. ¿Qué significa Sean? Y esa consideris. Wait, 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 wait. Uno primero. Alguien que me diga de ustedes qué es Sean. ¿Qué, es, ¿Qué está indicando esta palabra Sean? Equal is Sean. Mostrar, teacher. Good. Pero, pero mostrar que... Thank you very much. ¿Quién me dijo Paz Paricipo? ¿Quién? Me. Ilustrar. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Deme, deme cinco. Give me five. Give me five. Good, good, good. <laughs> okay, yes. Paz Paricipo, guys. And that is... Uh, remember that past participle we use it mostly for uh, for present perfect okay so past participle so the verb is show mostrar show is si tenemos los seis tiempos acuérdate show showing going to show showed show have shown have shown and was showing remember six tenses six tenses so, así es como convertimos esos, esos verbos en los seis tiempos. Ok, cool. Um, Teacher, in the second line, considering whether to people, whether. Uh, is, ya sea que, ya sea que. Eso es para whether, utilizar opciones. And the pronunciation is whether like a weather climate. Mm -hmm. yes, yes, climate, climate. Climate. Yeah, it's okay. the same thing. Ok. Only the, 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 the spelling is different, okay? Okay. Cool, cool. Thank you, Yesenia. Let's see who's next. Yeah. Um, let's see, Lydia. Read this, please. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. The superlative for is used for more than two people, thing or state, when one thing has qualities that exceed all the others. Superlative adjective have the in from, the da, in from. Da, ha, 
have that. Have, the, have that from or then, but it can be omitted. Omitted. Omitted in predicative position. Um, that is the smallest camera I have. Camera, ever seen. camera, camera. Camera I have ever seen. He gave the less expensive the least, gift. The least. To, the least expensive gift to his sister. I will have whichever is the ripest. Ripest, Nada se que dice esa última oración. Lidia, no tiren la cámara falla. Usted déle con todos los poderes, solo yo lo voy a estar aquí. Vamos, Lidia. No se preocupe. No se dé por vencida, ¿ok? Usted puede. Ok, guys. Um, so, in this case, it, this is is different to use comparative because comparative is comparing things, comparando. But the superlative is different. The superlative, it, it does compare, but with like the most. O sea, lo compara, pero sacándolo del resto. Okay, That's, that is the superlative. Okay, questions. Guys, questions. The ripest. Ripest, significa? the ripest. Ripest, ¿Qué significa? Okay, uh, do you like mangoes? Of course. Okay. How do you like mangoes? Uh, um, mango spicy. <laughs> but verde and spicy. Okay. Alguien más que, que sea contrario de verde y spicy. ¿Qué es, qué es contrario de verde y spicy? Maduro. Maduro y? Dulce. Sweet. So, maduro significa ripe, R-I-P-E, y ripe es el más maduro. Ese mango ya está maduro, ya está bien okay. bueno. <laughs> Thanks. Okay, good. That, that's the example, right. that's the example. Okay, um, any other question? We share it, we Oye, que alguien pidió una chica. Which, uh, which, uh, whichever. Oh, whichever. Cualquiera de, de ellos. Cualquiera de ellos. Whichever. Pronunciation omitted. Así, ¿verdad? Omitted. 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 Oh, qué cool. Sí. You say that I want so wrong. Okie dokie, let's go with the next. Si nadie tiene más preguntas. Eh, Catherine, can you read this place for us? There are two ways in which the comparative and superlative forms of adjectives are formed. You, you have er, er comparative or est superlative to the adjective. Adjectives which one syllable usually take these endings. Thank you very much. So as you can see, el comparativo lo, lo utilizamos, pero le ponemos ir, I mean, er al final. En cambio, los superlativos le ponemos est, ¿ok? Good. Pero con los que van con una sílaba, ya vamos a ver eso, eso cómo, cómo funciona, ¿ok? Questions. No questions. Cool, moving on. Okay, uh, okay, who's next? Karen, can you read this please? Comparative and superlatives, examples. Okay, bright, comparative brighter, superlative the brightest, long, comparative longer, superlative the longest, sharp, comparative sharper, superlative the sharpest. Good, do you understand this, uh, these uh, adjectives? Preguntas? Sharp. Sharp. Uh, uh, con, con filo. Sharper, con más filo. The sharpest, el más filudo. Hey, el más filudo. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Something like that. Okay, good. <laughs> Any other questions? No? So, como verán, está el comparativo que es sharper y el superlativo que es sharpest. Good? Cool. Moving on. Okay, Claudia, can you read this, please? If the word already ends in E, 
the E must be left off. You know, if a word ends in J, why, 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 it usually takes R or S, and the Y changes to E. Changes to I. Changes to I. Changes to I. Very good. Okay, so check out this rule. If the word already ends in E, the, the E must be left off. So le quitamos esa E. If a word ends in Y, it usually takes ER or EST, and the Y changes to I. So no solamente le vamos a poner EER o EST, sino que la Y va a cambiar a I. Okay? Good. Um, ¿Quién leyó? Catherine, right? Catherine, pero también las, las, la, los ejemplos, please. It wasn't me. <laughs> yeah, ¿Quién fue? Sorry, sorry, Catherine. Claudia. Oh, Claudia, Claudia. Los yeah. ejemplos, please. Wise, comparative, wiser. Superlative, the wisest. Pretty, comparative, pretty. Superlative, the prettiest. Very good. Weary, comparative, weary. And superlative, the weariest. Very good. Okay, so that's how you have it. Y si se fijan en wise, wisest, solo le ponemos la ER. En cambio, con pretty, pierde la Y, pero se convierte en I. Y le, y le ponemos el ER. ¿Got it? ¿Ven cómo se usa? Cool. Cool. All right. Quiero ver quién va después. Marixa, can you read this, please? Marixa, can you read it? Okay, sorry. It's okay. Do I the word? Okay. Do I do I the word more or most in front of the adjective? Adjectives with the three syllable 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 syllables syllables syllable or or more use more or not in front of the adjective. For Fortunate, 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 comparative, for, for, fortunate, superlative, the most fortunate, 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 relevant, 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 more comparative, more relevant. The most relevant. Very good. So as you can see, if if the adjective has three syllables, so we have to put more or most, more or most. Okay. How to identify the syllables? ¿Cómo vamos a identificar las sílabas? Hagan esto. Ojo, véame. Um, si quiere identificar las sílabas es así. Ojo. Si si veo la palabra for, for, fortunate, so digo for to net tres sílabas for to net tres sílabas si veo oh. relevant entonces yo digo relevant tres sílabas ¿Oh? good si nos vamos anteriormente anterior a eso miren si vemos la palabra wiser digamos why ser solo dos sílabas si decimos pretty pretty dos sílabas Si decimos weary, we re, dos sílabas. Mm -hmm. Si se fijan cómo identificarlo, ¿verdad? Fácil, facilito. Yeah. Ok. Cool. All right, who's next? Let me see who's next. Rocío, Rocío ya pasó, ¿no? Ronald, Ronald. Uh, Ronald, can you read this please? Ok. Uh, adjective firm, firm it. From participles use more or must as well. Uh, I shall be provoking. 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 Okay. Uh, provoking. Comparative more provoking. Is uh, superlative the most provoking. Okay. It says. Uh, in trail. In trail. In trail. Uh, comparative mm -hmm. more in trail. Superlative the most in trail. Okay, as you can see, adjectives form from participles. Estos ya son participios, okay? Pa participio ing y participio past participio, okay? So they use more y most, 
¿Ok? ¿Y cuántas sílabas tiene? Provoking. Provoking. Entrao. Entrault. Como queda como con la ed. ed por eso. Entrault. Ok. Um, who's next? Rocío, you, you already. No, Yesenia. Yesenia, can you do this? Okay. Uh, to indicate the opposite of both the. Let me check. The ER. The, the, the ER is in the model mode for all comparison. Less or less is always used. Comparative, sharp. Superlative, less sharp. The least sharp. Fortunate, less fortunate. The least fortunate. Interesting. Interesting. Less interesting. 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 Uh, interesting, less interesting. The least interesting. Involved, less involved. The least involved. Thank you very much. So as you can see here, to indicate opposite of both ER or ES. So ER is the comparison, is the comparison and EST is the superlative. So to, to do the opposite, we are going to use less or least, okay? So in this case, chart, less chart. What does it mean when it says less chart? ¿Qué significa cuando dice less chart? Menos filudo. Menos filo. Con menos men filo. Con menos filo. Con menos filo. Y cuando dice the least chart. Más filudo. No. Más no. filo. Opósito. Menos filudo. Opósito. Opos mm. Opuesto, digo. <risa> Opuesto. El menos filudo. El, ah. el, el que menos tiene filo. El que menos tiene filo. ¿Ok? Ah, ya. Yeah. ¿Ya? Vamos. Yeah. Veamos ese otro, otro ejemplo. Interesting. ¿Qué es interesting? Interesante. Interesante. Interesantísimo. No. Interesante. Vale, si digo less interesting, ¿qué estoy diciendo? Less interesting. Menos interesante. Menos interesante. Pero si digo the least interesting. El menos interesante. El menos. El menos interesante. No, less más interesante. Interesante. Less interesting. El más. Oye, oh, yeah, un momento, un momento. Less interesting <risa> es menos interesante, pero the Ajá. least interesting es el menos interesante. Ah. ¿Ok? Solo so lo saca de todos y dice el menos. ¿Ok? Cool. Entendimos oh. todos. Ojo, quiero que entiendan, no se vayan con dudas, please. El de least es como el, lo, lo más o lo menos interesante. Lo menos. Y less es más interesante. O sea, menos, sí, pero menos que, siempre, pero, menos. pero. Ajá, pero el, el, lo que es menos de menos es el list. El list. Ah, ok. Vale, le vamos a un ejemplo, un ejemplo. Un ejemplo. Um, hablemos de carros. De carros. ¿Cuál, ¿Cuál sería? Si yo tengo, digamos, tengo un Lamborghini, tengo un Volkswagen y tengo un, un, ¿qué? un Toyota. Toyota. <ríe> Toyota, Volkswagen y Lamborghini. ¿Cuál es el less interest? ¿Cuál, es, cuál sería el less interest? El Toyota. El Toyota, very good. ¿Y cuál sería the least interesting? El volvaje. El volvaje. Claro que sí. Va, ya ven. Sí lo entendieron. Ya, yeah, good. That's nice. Good. Ok. Um, who's next? Um, let's see. Who's next? Ok, Byron. Can, can you read this, please? Yes, teacher. Ayatis with two syllables, including those that already end in Air? ER, can, ER, ER, can follow either pattern or sometimes both patterns. If you are double about doubtful, 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 
doubtful about a two-syllable adjective use the more mods pattern. Very good. So adjectives with two syllables, including can follow either pattern or sometimes both patterns. If you're doubtful about the two-syllable adjective, use the more or most. Bueno, cuando se encuentren en dudas, es lo que dice aquí, cuando ustedes se encuentren en dudas, siempre váyanse a lo que no falla, utilizar more y most. Okay, si tienen dudas de una de un de una de una palabra de cuántas sílabas tiene, váyanse con more y most. Okay, preguntas, questions. No. Patterns. Patterns. Okay. Patterns. Patrones. Patrones. Patterns. Sin un patrón. O sea, si se encuentran en dudas, siguen el patrón de usar more o most. ¿Ok? ¿Cómo se pronuncia, no. teacher? Patrón. Pattern. Pattern. Ok. Pattern. Ok, como vieron, este es eh, un poquito extensivo porque eh, explica las dos cosas. Tanto el comparativo como el superlativo. Ojo, ¿cómo lo hago? Comparativo y el superlativo. El superlativo sobresale de todo. En cambio, el comparativo se compara entre, la, entre los que lo rodean. ¿Ok? ¿Questions? ¿Preguntas? ¿Dudas? No. Everybody's like, what? What is the teacher talking about? Ok, so, no. Ok, chicos, miren qué rápido se va el tiempo. Vuela, vuela, vuela. Um, la música, teacher. Yo, bueno, hay alguien que se me quería dormir con la música, dijo. Bueno, Samuel creo que está dormido. ¿Samuel? <risa> <risa> ok, ok, guys. So, I'll see you tomorrow, God willing, the same time and same thing. Ok, so, I'll see you tomorrow. Have a good night's sleep. Bye-bye. Good, okay. good night. Good night. Good night. Bye. Bye. Have a good night. Bye, teacher. Bye, teacher. Bye, bye. Good night. Bye. Have a good night. Bye, bye. Bye, bye, teacher. Bye, teacher. Bye, teacher. Have a good see night. you tomorrow. See you see tomorrow, you. too. <laughs> Good night. See you tomorrow.